don't install these ugly vents. Let's upgrade them with fits. They offer several different sizes and styles, but we're gonna be going with their double channel flush mount. Since these are their flush mount vents, we need to install it before the flooring is in place. So I went ahead and took the damper, made sure it was square with my already existing floor, and took measurements of where it was. After the flooring was installed, I was able to measure where it was underneath so that I could drill through to it. Now I'm gonna grab my router with a flush cut bit and go ahead and set it to just below the flooring so that it follows the damper underneath and we get a perfect cutout. This will leave us with slightly rounded corners, but I just like to take a file to square those up. Then I used the damper flaps to hold the upper vent in place flush with the floor while I installed the four screws in the corners that keep it secure. Now we need the flooring for the inside of the vent, so I traced it onto the cutout and then took it out to the saw to make a few cuts. Glued on a couple spacers, set it in the vent, and it's all set to install. I absolutely love how sleek and seamless these vents are, so I want you to check out the transformation one more time. There's the before and after, and if you liked how that turned out, check out their wall vents, which also come in framed and flush mount options. And that's how I was able to take our vents to the next level with fits.